Hey guys, I'm Dr. David Lim, board certified laser dermatologist. Uh, today we are at the Fiori Institute of Body Contouring and we're talking about body contouring and body contouring treatments or fat reduction treatments. So, uh, it's a little bit different compared to what I normally do, which is basically laser and aesthetics on the face. Um, today we're talking about fat reduction. Okay, so who's a good candidate for um, a non-surgical um, removal of unwanted fat? Basically it's this. If you eat well, um, so if you're healthy, um, just eat a sensible diet. We're not asking you to actually go out there and have you know, an egg a day and a little bit of brown rice at night. Look, it, it's just eat a sensible diet, exercise sensibly. We're not after cardio for 30, 40 minutes a day. Just exercise sensibly as any adult would. Um, so these are the essential facts, uh, right? So it's not a shortcut method. It just helps you uh, reduce those areas of unwanted fat. Now, um, for fat, there are basically two kinds. There's visceral fat, and with visceral fat, there's only two ways to actually reduce that. Diet and exercise. And then there's subcutaneous fat. Subcutaneous fat is what you can pinch, uh, which lies on top of or above your abdominal uh, muscles. So basically, it's that you know, love handles which you can grab. So that's visceral fat. For visceral fat, you've got several options. You can have surgical options, for example, liposuction, um, or you can have non-surgical options. If we're talking about non-surgical options, uh, you basically have two methods in order to treat it. The first one is called cryolipolysis. So we're using cooling systems to actually break down that tissue. So the time-tested treatment is called cool sculpting. Um, I've had, I've done, I've used it for over six years. Uh, it's extremely reliable. Um, worldwide, there's over two million procedures performed. Uh, I know that my team's performed over two thousand procedures in the last um, uh, five to six years. Um, but there are other newer um, devices such as Cooltech, which can provide a good or if not sometimes even better result than cool sculpting. So just remember, cool sculpting is generation one. Uh, newer devices are certainly out there. Uh, and I'm not here to compare and say which one's better, but the best. I'm basically here to educate. So uh, cool sculpting is the one that's been out there the longest. Um, Cooltech certainly um, is a new play in the market. And um, yeah, we do have it as well uh, because um, they have different size applicators and the applicator size is very very important because that determines the success of the treatment whether it's going to fail or whether it's going to work okay so the second way to treat um, unwanted fat is through um, thermolysis which is basically break down the fat using heat so heat can be generated by using um, a laser, for example, like this, which is um, Sculpture. I personally have had this treatment myself. It works for me. It doesn't work for everyone, but it does work. Um, and yeah, like I said, it does work for me. And I'll show you that video in the next couple of months. So certainly using a diode laser like this to actually heat fat can work. Um, also, fat can be reduced by using um, other methods, which I will show you at a later stage. So we do have the um, ND med um, system as well. So using RF or radio frequency, um, Venus freeze, lots of other devices which can actually heat fat. So that can actually help as well. So um, when we're talking about um, subcutaneous fat, those are the only ways. And by far the most reliable method I find, actually use our cool sculpting uh, in this application to actually reduce unwanted pockets of fat. Hang tight. Good. Hey, look, um, you are getting some treatments done today, yeah? I am. Okay, now, um, yeah, hey, well, tell me what, what brings you here and what is your main concern and why are you doing it? I'm one of these people, I'm 51, and I look after myself. I go to the gym at least five times a week with a mix of weights and cardio. I eat really well during the week. Um, but I just have pockets of fat that won't go and as you know when you go to the gym you can't target your fat loss so I've just got this one little stubborn bulge yep. that I want you to remove okay cool <laughs> please cool 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 <laughs> okay so that's a very common phenomenon where people um, eat healthy um, they live well they exercise they do everything within reasonable limits I say um, but still have an enjoyable life yeah yes um, but then you just as I know as well at my age once you hit a certain age no matter what you do can't get rid of that um, stubborn area of um, fat so we'll see what we can do um, for um, Tracy we're going to use um, 
uh, a particular method to deliver the results. So um, we'll see how this is assessed very shortly. So hang tight, guys. Mel, who's our cool sculptor, yeah? yeah. So hey, um, Mel, can you run us through the logic of what, I mean, we've got access to a heap of devices, everything from uh, cool sculpting through to sculpture with damage, all therapy, I mean, just the whole lot, yeah? Now, you have chosen uh, cool sculpting, yeah, with a particular um, uh, applicator. Can you run us through the logic of why you did it and how you actually came up with that conclusion? Um, sure. So today we're doing um, Tracy's flank area, flanks area. Yep. Um, I've selected cool sculpting and I've selected the curved applicator. So the curved applicator will contour to the, that sh that area of the body. Cool, cool. Um, with Tracy, um, we have a peak on the left hand okay, side. Okay, can we let's have a look at this, uh, Tracy? Let's face up there, and I might get you to yeah, and just yeah, yeah, just go through the logic. So when with we that. look at the flank flank area on Tracy. We've got the left hand side which has a slight peak here where the right hand side is quite flat. Okay, while well, I'm going to get you there, Tracy, if you, if you don't mind just turning around and that way we can see. Okay, cool. Okay, so yeah, let's go through that again. So we've selected the curved applicator yep. for the left hand side and we're going to avoid treating the right hand side. Right. If we treat over areas that don't have any peaks or bulges, we can end up with indents in the area. Okay. So what we're going to do to even out this area is we're going to treat on the left hand side, yep. um, straight over the peak centrally yep. um, with the Cool Sculpting curved applicator. Cool, um, cool. Multiple sessions may be required yep, yep. Um, to get the de desired result. So we yep. are looking for a 25% fat cell reduction cool. of the treated fat cells. Cool, cool, cool. So, um, yeah, and hey, I know that you've had it uh, done as well, haven't you? I have, yeah, plenty of times. Plenty of times. <laughs> you don't mind if we looked at your before and afters later on? No, we can bring that yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, cool, 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 cool. Yeah. Um, uh, cool. So, look, um, let's go through the whole process of the applicator, uh, application of the applicator, and uh, we'll show you how it's done. Okay guys, so the first thing what we do is we um, have just applied a gel pad over here and the gel pad um, was measured up um, and that acts as a, um, a protector and an applicator. So gel pad first and then the applicator coming up very shortly. You're going to feel a suction to the area. Okay guys, so this is the most essential part. Um, this is the <laughs> this is the icebreaker, this is the deal breaker. Um, if we can get um, the applicator, which we know we have because we've actually measured it, uh, into the area, we've got good suction, and when that happens, it basically lifts up the skin together with the um, uh, fat cells in that area of the bulge into the applicator, and that freezes it. Now, with the old systems, it used to take 60 minutes. This new system takes 35 minutes. So it's a 35 minute application time, um, and it's to minus 11 degrees. For the first six minutes, it's a little bit uncomfortable for the patient, and then, nah. No, Tracy's I didn't feel a thing that I went on. Yet. No, oh, but you said you're, you're a little bit uncomfortable because boobs weren't made for, <laughs> beds, uh, beds weren't made for boobs? Beds weren't made for boobs. Okay, there you have it guys, didn't come from me, it came from her. Okay, so look, so on a serious note, this is the most important bit. The applicator has got to fit in. Uh, and I'll go through why it's so important with the, uh, with the application um, cycle, because if you do not get the applicator on, uh, and if you do not get the end result, which I'll show you later, you will not get a result. So the application is extremely important. So we have different type of cool sculpting machines. Basically, this is, our, I think it's our first generation. Um, we've had this, well, I've done about 2,000 treatments in the last five years. Um, this is the first generation. I think we've got about three cool sculpting machines. Uh, this is the newest, which is the um, Advantage. So you can see it's 35 minutes, um, not the old 60 minutes. Uh, and there's the countdown. So we'll come back to Tracy in um, 34 minutes time and we'll see the end result and what's expected. Tracy, you all comfortable there, mate? Good, eh? I don't feel a thing. You don't feel a thing? No. That's because you're female and you're tough. <laughs> <laughs> if I were to have this, uh, I would, <laughs> I'll probably be squirming. But anyway, we'll be back shortly. So why do we have so many applicator sizing machines? So you can see, I'll show you shortly why it's so important to actually have so many applicators because no two body shapes are alike. And if you're doing, um, I guess, cryolipolysis, in this case, cool sculpting, 
or um, cool tech to a really high standard. We basically have a bespoke treatment. In other words, we have different applicators for different reasons. So you can see over here with the max, it actually is what it says, it's maximum. Then we actually have the um, curve, and then we have the core, and we have the smooth for the thighs, or the outer thighs, and then we have the mini. And then, uh, so the Mini's really good. So this, I reckon this is gonna be a game changer because it really is gonna compete with stuff like Codbella and Belcara for the, um, the chin. Uh, it can also be used for basically anywhere you can think that this applicator is gonna fit. So it can be used for um, the backs, it can be used for even the knees, uh, it can be used even for, bit, for the pectoral areas. A lot of guys come in and they want their pecs um, sculpt. Um, so this is a really, really um, cool device because it's, uh, it's called a Mini. And as you can see, even with um, the other devices from Cooltech, you can see the applicator sizes, are, some of them are really, really deep because you have the deep pockets of fat, some of them are actually narrower, and some of them are actually broader. So you can see, in order to actually do really good cryolipolysis, it's not just two or three applicators. It's the whole series in different shapes, in different sizes, and that gives you the best result because as soon as we can get that pocket of fat to actually get into that area and we get a good seal, we get a good result full stop. Um, unlike using heat where it's a bit of hit and miss because everyone basically can use a applicator or fit on a, uh, a sculpture, these are very specific. So that's why we can actually contour different areas of your body and basically um, contour it to a point where it's, you know, we get predictable results. So guys, that is um, really important to understand, predictability and the various devices that we use. Thanks for that. Okay guys, so now it looks like um, treatment's over. So we've been through 35 minutes of cooling and we are removing the applicator. So here we go guys, here's the popsicle. So applicator's coming off gradually but slowly and watch what happens so you see that that is what we call a popsicle and icicle that area there is hard to palpate um, and that area is frozen so it's really super important this bit is really really important to actually massage sometimes we use something called a zimmer to actually break down the area but in this case because it's such a small area Firm massage is all that's needed. Needed uh, because the air is so cold, it's virtually painless. Am I right there? Yeah, no pain. Yep. No pain at all. Yeah, because it's actually sub-zero, so it's <laughs> minus seven. So remember, if, you, if your hands are actually so cold, uh, you actually don't feel pain at all. So massaging is extremely important, uh, and we get the patient to massage as well at night. Um, and this, in most cases. Um, has minimal limitations on the patient's, um, I guess, lifestyle over the next couple of days. Uh, Tracy probably miss. Are you going to the gym today? You're going to miss it. No, I'm going to the gym. You're going to the gym. She's going to the gym. She's had a couple of these treatments. It doesn't affect her at all. Um, in the worst case scenario, you do get a little bit of tingling, a little bit of redness, uh, but that usually settles down within uh, 48 to 72 hours. So it's minimal downtime. But for Tracy, it's, it is a no downtime procedure. Um, we will get back to the before and after results. This, remember, like I said, this does take three months before we actually see the results, the full results, because it's your body's immune system which actually carries the fat away. Um, that's it, guys. And hey, Tracy, thanks for showing this. Thanks for allowing us to show that. Cool. So, what are the before and afters like? Following cool sculpting, you can see there's a marked improvement that this does take approximately three months. So some patients need one treatment, some patients need two, depending on their expectations. Regardless, uh, results are there. This is basically using a dual sculpting, um, and you can see what happens with the flanks. Like I said, it's a very good way to actually contour um, the areas. Uh, it can be applied to your outer thighs and also your inner thighs as well. Uh, and this is a more subtle um, result after eight weeks. So once again, it does take time. This is basically two uh, sessions, four months later. Um, with multiple sessions, you get more improvement. So there's no limitations as to how much fat you can actually remove. Just as long as it fits in the applicator, we have a good result. So time and patience together with application size gives you the results. This is Cooltech. Like I said, this is Mel. Remember Mel who actually uh, performed the procedure. This is her using Cooltech. We do find that this is an excellent modality.
So guys, in summary, it's this. Um, always eat healthy. Um, go on the, on the appropriate diet and exercise. This uh, method of body contouring is no substitute for uh, a good diet and a healthy lifestyle. Okay, so that's the first take home message. It's not a shortcut, guys. The second is that um, if you're gonna use a device uh, that's gonna work, usually it's cold. So cryolipolysis works um, more predictably than using a machine such as this, which is uh, sculpture, which uses heat. So heat in the form of lasers or radio frequency, like in the med and all the other devices, which I'll go through at a later stage, can actually work. But if you're looking at a, um, a, a way to contour your actual um, um, body areas, it's actually cryolipolysis or coal, which actually works a lot better. As always, um, always consult someone who can do the whole lot. So basically I have uh, colleagues who are plastic surgeons. So someone comes to see me and, and they are, have a BMI of 42 and need to lose weight over a period of two months. None of these devices and none of these devices um, will actually work. So liposuction is the only way to go. A surgical um, is the only way to go. So see someone who can actually provide the entire range of services, including um, treatments for both uh, coal, which is cryolipolysis using cool sculpting, but make sure they have different size applicators. And that's why we also use devices like cool sculpting, cool tech. Um, also, okay, so heat can actually work as well. So if someone needs to reduce their uh, body fat in the trunkal area with minimal downtime, that's where heat can actually uh, come into play. So devices like Sculpture can certainly work and uh, radio frequency devices like IndyMed, um, Dimage um, and various others can actually work. And last of all guys, um, it's your body's immune system which is the rate limiting factor. So that's why it takes three months for optimal results. Um, it's your body's lymphatics which actually carries it away. It's not instant gratification and it's not like um, just blasting away fat and then it goes. It doesn't work like that. That's liposuction. Okay, so this is non-invasive with minimal downtime. Hey guys, look, thanks very much for watching this video. Um, I'll go through the other uh, procedures and the other devices which we use um, in the upcoming months. Um, if you like this, please subscribe. I do one educational video every Saturday morning, Brisbane time. So I'll see you next week. Bye. If you're new to this channel, I produce one video every Saturday um, at Brisbane time. So this channel is dedicated towards laser and aesthetic dermatology as to what works and what doesn't. I'm also on Instagram and I post a couple of new videos and a few pics. So if you're bored, follow me on Instagram and you might learn something um, during the week. Um, thanks for that, guys. Bye.